For today, in the name of freedom, we take the battle to them. It's more like just an entertaining thing yeah. for you, whereas for me, I'm like actually trying to find some good stuff. Astro Train! <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Alfonso Nation? Alfonso Peterman here today. Welcome, one and all, to another episode of Epic Toy Hunting. We have left the city of Lafayette, and we're at another city at the very current moment, and we're going to check to see what they have at this Walmart. Never been to this one at all in the entire season, and I'm excited to see what we're going to find. There's a lot that we can prepare for. We got Blitzwing and Clip Jumper and a lot of other figures that I've never actually seen from the previous waves I'm excited for. So without further ado, on to the hunt. I'm this Walmart is beautiful. Oh my god. This Walmart is beautiful and I'm jealous. Because we don't have this in Lafayette. yet. This Walmart is insane. I don't know what to expect because I've never been here at all in 2020. I'm, I don't even know where the section is. So we have to hunt for the section first. And then we have to hunt for the figure. Here's the thing. It's somewhere in the store. It's somewhere in the <laughs> store. So we know that. Even in here, no freaking Black Panther Marvel. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, buddy. It looks like there's a lot over there. Yeah. Um, calm down. Chill. All right, you still got another store to go. Can you chill for a second? Can you go down to a few beats per minute? I am, I am, I, I, I am. Oh, my. Whoa. 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 Look. Yeah. Take a look. <laughs> This is like the first time in a long time where I actually see a complete section. There's no stop. gaps. Stop. There's stop. leader, fully stocked. Leader, Voyager, and Deluxe for everything. <laughs> Earthrise Prime, let's go. I'm, I just love seeing him. And he's, he has his head. He has the head. Double dealer. No, that's not Double Dealer. Yeah, Double Dealer is there. And Astro Train! So we got Double Dealer, Astro Train, and Earthrise Prime. We got the uh, Blaster reissue down here. Check him out, baby. Check him out. Uh, I I don't know. It, but this might be the first time we're ever seeing Sentinel Prime in Walmart. We've always found him in Target. And why is there an Earthrise Clip Jumper? <laughs> Hanging out. He's like... I'm so tired of you guys. Frankly, I think we don't get enough attention. We need to get more attention. Clip jumper, I always get killed, so I'm not part of the group, okay? I'm removing myself from the group. I'm impeaching myself. I'm removing myself. <laughs> I'm in front of behind the camera. <laughs> yeah, clip jumper's like, you know what? I, I'm not part of this because every time I show up, you guys kill me. So I'm going to hang out with the minions <laughs> because at least they're not going to kill me. So I don't blame you, Cliff. I don't. I really don't. I really don't. Uh, we got Earthrise, Starscream, Megatron to the con in the middle of your drawn in the con in the... Why am I... See, I need to stop rapping. I need to stop rapping. Like, forever, for all time. Uh, we got Toist here for Earthrise. We got the Off-Road B, which is pretty dope. Shatter for Jet Shatter. I mean, like, completely stocked, guys. Um, I know Left Foot, Left, Left Foot, yeah. Left Foot, mm -hmm. Left Foot, it's, it's his name. We got Roadbuster Soundwave, so... A good bit of these guys. I mean, like, this, this is stocked. Sideswipe for the Netflix series Mirage. I mean, dude, a whole bunch of Mirages. I've never seen a Walmart this this packed before. Like, there's not enough room for anything else. Um, Sound Blaster, baby. Come on now. Come on now. Let's go. Hey, Snapdragon, baby. Come on. Guys. I don't know if you guys know, but this this was a drive. It's a good little drive from Lafayette. Um, we're not in Lafayette right now. So the fact that we took this drive and it was successful and we found things, I'm very, very happy. I'm pleased we, with it. So yeah, far. of course. Uh, not We didn't find Lafayette, of course. And, of course, there's a, there's a couple of other, you know, like Blitzwing and 
uh, clip jumper for Studio Series, top spin. We didn't find any of these guys yet, but hopefully we will soon, and that's what the hope is. But I'm just glad that we have stuff to show, because I hate pulling up and there's nothing, you know? <laughs> Mixmaster, we got Scavenger, Shockwave, and Scavenger. No overload. I'm actually shocked. I thought they would have had overload. Um, but I'm glad we have a Shockwave in there. Netflix Megatron, Netflix Hotlink, dude, dude, god dang, anybody who comes here will have a whole lot to choose from, my goodness. Push these guys back, we got World War II Hot Rod, Shatter, and Soundwave. Wow, okay, Wheeljack, dude, brings a tear to my eye, I'm gonna wipe the tear real quick. <laughs> There's a lot here. There's a lot. I've never, I, this is like, if not my first time ever, my first time in a long, long time seeing everything. The ones that I'm personally looking for, of course, will be the new ones. And then hopefully, I don't, I've, I've personally never found this guy yet, which is sad. But Studio Series 49 Bumblebee, which is the, is the Bumblebee with the battle mask. I want to get that one. So yeah, man, I, I'm excited to see what's next. There's a couple things here I didn't get yet and that I would really think about doing. So I'm going to do that, and then we're going to go back yeah. to Walmart. Yes, of course, sir. milk chat in the middle. <laughs> Let's do that. Got that fresh cut. Just going <laughs> to just put that fresh cut in there. Throw it in there. Big shout out to my hairdresser, Bree. She is a legend. She is a gift from the heavens. A legend. An actual legend. Really? And uh, she got my hair cut. And I'm loving it. I, I mean, every time she does it, I love it. But she really just... I literally go to my barber and I'm like, hey, uh, just just do it. She's like, what do you want? I was like, just, <laughs> just do whatever just you want. figure it out. You do whatever it. you want. And she always, she never fails. So. Anyway. Fresh cut. Oh, for yeah. The for the mug chat. We're returning with Raisin Canes. I know we had this before, but we do eat this a lot. It's so good. Like, it's just, my favorite place. Just tell me... You can't tell me that this is not It's good delicious. And cases. if you've never had it, do. Do that. What is the worst figure you've ever got? Here's my thing. I don't buy stuff I don't like. <laughs> <laughs> like, I've never bought the helicopter dropkick. I've seen it a million times. And I won't buy it. So, it's hard to find the worst when I like them all so equally. But... I would probably have to say it is the uh, Dark of the Moon Barricade. What? The original one. Okay. It's a little poo. And I barely, like, show it. I have a picture of it on screen, but I barely, like, show it or use it. I just leave it in the alt mode in the police car because it looks the best as the police okay. car. Yep. <laughs> And the robot mode is poo. Hey Alfonso, do you have any plans to go back and check out the toy room for Toy Hunt? Yes. Um, what I'm waiting for is I'm waiting for him to message me. He said that whenever he gets new Transformers or when he gets something really cool to show off, he'll he'll like text me, say, hey, I got it. So if you want to make a video, let me know. Just let you know. Yeah. Um, I know he did get a uh, Scorponok. He got like four of those and some other Earthrise stuff. So that's cool. But uh, whenever he orders like a good bit and he finally gets them in, that's when he lets me know. So we are going to go back to the toy room. We would have done it today, but they're closed on Sundays, and it is Sunday, so. It is Sunday here. Yeah, so uh, no, no no, toy room, but we will be back over there. I know it's, I don't think we've, I think we've only been back. We haven't been there in a minute. Yeah, it's been a minute. Yeah. I did go, like I do, if you guys follow me on Instagram, which you should, if you don't, you're fired. You're fired, frankly, I think you're fired. I went uh, recently to buy a Marvel Legends Black Panther, because he had it in stock so that's on instagram so i do go but for the actual youtube videos i will do it soon what is the best thing about youtube for you <sighs> you guys you guys are the best thing about youtube and i know it's like so like corny cliche. and cliche but it really you guys really are the best because some i mean some folks would say oh it's the money you know, because you can make good money. Or some folks will say, oh, it's the views. Or some will say, it's the sponsorships. Or it's the, I don't know, the opportunity or the, you know, whatever. I really think it's the people that you meet. 
Because yeah. I've met so many freaking legends. And I'm going to shout y'all out. Rage Nation, Alex, you are an absolute <laughs> legend. Like, you're a, a really good friend, and I would have never met you had I not pursued YouTube the way I did. And you helped inspire, I mean, literally, the Alfonso Nation, Rage Nation. <laughs> like, I got the name from you um, when I was younger. TFI Creations, you're my boy. T Fan Page. Uh, you know, you're a good friend. Uh, Optibotomus, man. My boy <laughs> Paul, man. Jobby, we don't talk much, but uh, you're a good guy. There's so many people I've met from this platform. Just incredible people. And, and it only goes up from here, too. Yeah, and it only goes uphill. And the fans. I, I, I can know your names by heart. Fade it, Figment, like the, the constant people. So cool. Phil Smith. I can just think of names of really great people I've met. And even people that like, I've known, Gabrielle in uh, Lithuania. You guys are awesome. And I didn't say your name, I'm sorry, if I didn't say it. But There's just so many, though. There's a lot of you guys, but I really do appreciate every last one of you. And I think y'all are the best, yeah, y'all are the best thing, just meeting people. Are you gonna build Devastator or not? <laughs> yes, I am gonna build Devastator. But I know I've said previously, like, I'm only gonna get, like, like I'm gonna get all the of the figures time. at once, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then, and then combine them. It will be in a form of like a live on YouTube, I think. I think I'm gonna do like that kind of format. Or I might do a video, just make it very long, and then like cut it. But yeah, I wanna I wanna definitely combine Devastator. Cause like, he's so awesome to see on the pictures. I can just imagine in person. He'd be so great. I don't know where I'm gonna put him. I don't, but I'm gonna He'd figure it out. He'd be really fun to transform. Oh yeah. Leo, if you encountered a Decepticon, what would you do? And what is your favorite scene in Dark of the Moon? Oh, well, Dark of the Moon is the one where Starscream died. Yeah, that's where Starscream now, died. I may say, the way Sam did kill him, though, was pretty badass. I think that's probably one of my favorite scenes, considering it is the death of my favorite. That's probably one of my favorite scenes in Dark of the Moon. So the death of Starscream is your favorite scene? Yeah. It's hot what? I think the way it was played out, it did okay. very well. You know, like the battle that yeah. took place? Yeah. Like the way he was swinging around? <laughs> Yeah, that is pretty cool. So that's your favorite of the whole movie? Yeah. All right. And if you encountered a Decepticon in real life, what would you do? Like, if you just, like, you're, like, walking in the mall or something. And then you're walking outside. And then, like, it's, like, nighttime. It's an empty parking lot. There's no cameras. There's nobody. And the thing just transforms. It goes, Rrr. What would What would be your reaction? Would you, like, freeze? Would you try to, like, talk with I'd probably it? Try and go, I'd probably try and go live as quick as possible. <laughs> Yo, I what's up, guys? <laughs> I'm here with your boy Soundwave, baby. What's up, Soundwave? <laughs> Where is the cube? Uh, I would literally try to film as quickly as possible. You, just you so, would pull out just some... so there'd be evidence of it happening. I, I, you know, I feel that. I think that's something I would do too. I'd hide and film from where I'm hiding. Or at least. Try oh, okay, okay. So like, room. run, hide, and, and while they're and looking you know, for you, you just kind of peek out the camera. Yeah, get a little bit of action, you know. That's a very. <laughs> That's a very sophisticated method, um, but I like it. That's like something you see in the movie too. Will Leo ever buy a Transformers with you? Almost in every toy hunt, he didn't buy anything. Well, he did buy that Voyager Revenge of the Fallen, but Alfonso bought for Leo. Leo is not coming on these hunts to get the figures. <laughs> I'm coming to look, yeah. looking at the figures, and actually like looking at their alt modes, looking yeah. at their transform modes, just checking them out. They look. Amazing. That's what I come to do for. Yeah. I don't necessarily collect them. No. Um, if I did start collecting them, I would buy them more. But being that I don't collect them, he doesn't collect. It them. would just be a waste of money. Right. And I don't collect them either. <laughs> I buy some of them now. I will buy them, but I don't collect anything outside of Optimus Prime. And I've said this multiple times. But Leo doesn't collect any of them. He just likes to check them out. Yeah. And he comes. It's fun to do the toy hunts. I mean, this is fun. We hang out and joke around and film so it's 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 a and more eat. and eat <laughs> so it's a fun uh, it's more like just an entertaining thing yeah for you whereas for me i'm like actually trying to find some good stuff Astro Train! <laughs> <laughs> what are your thoughts on ss48 and are you planning on picking up studio series 48 megatron from universal studios i would have if i had the chance to go when i had the trip booked in march i was gonna buy a lot i had like i had 500 dollars saved just for buying stuff? Just for figures to buy. Wow. Because I knew that when I go to, like, the ride, and I would go into, like, the supply vault store, I would splurge. I knew that, because I know myself. 
I've never been inside of a store that was all Transformers. I would have been in love with it. I want, I want that. I want that. I want that. There's somewhere in Destin that when you walk in and there's this huge, like, figure, like a huge statue. Yeah. Optimus. Oh, that's so cool. I was going to buy the AllSpark replica at the Ooh. Universal Studios. They have one. It was a few hundred bucks. I might have bought, like, maybe, like, an autographed thing. I don't know. Um, and I would have bought the Evax. I would have bought so much shirts, hats. I, I would have been decked out. The AllSpark short, I think they had, like, a necklace for that. I'd have, I, man, I'd have been so decked out by now. But, uh, as of now, I I don't know if I'll get them. If I do get the Dark Animal Megatron, I'll go for that one. I won't go for the one that's in the store. Well, thank you guys so much for all the questions. I do appreciate it. Um, I will continue to Walmart in Lafayette, and it's going to be fun. I don't think I'm going to find any of the new stuff in this one, but uh, we will continue until we do. Hmm. There's no way to try. We're surrounded by, by, uh, <laughs> by shoppers. All right, well, we have arrived. Take a look. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. I think I'm gonna leave the mask going. Yeah. There's people <laughs> hanging around. Um, not too bad, though. I'm looking at it, and it doesn't look bad. Good stuff. Uh, we got Shatter, Jet Mode. I'm seeing a lot of her. At first, I was hard to find uh, Shatter. But I'm seeing her a lot now. <laughs> now that the other waves are coming through, she's showing up more when I want the other ones to show up. Um, we've got some Netflix series stuff, some Earthrise in here. We got Roadbuster, Hotlink, uh, Starscream. Ooh, that's my boy. Yeah, if nobody's in the aisle, don't cancel me. Uh, every time I come, every time I like do any type of hunt, uh, I see that there is Earthrise, Starscream. And I do you need <laughs> every time I come, uh, there is uh, an Earthrise Star Scream that I uh, I hesitate to get. We're going to take a look at Shatter and <laughs> what the. F Freaking crap was that? <laughs> Leo, what the hell was that? I get it. I'm filming and this is a place for shopping. I understand. But no, excuse me. Or no, um, could I just... Nothing! Not even a hello, not an icon, nothing. And she's like, like, who are, you are not entitled. That, that took immense self-restraint to not say anything. Cause like, I try to, I try to be respectful of everybody. Nice, you know, I just try to show some decency to people. And as you can see, it doesn't always happen to me. Even, even, look. Even he decided to be quiet today. He chose to be quiet. He said, you know what? I've been bothering you a lot. You probably had a long day. Didn't find nothing new. I'm going to shut up for you and let you do your thing. I appreciate it, by the way. I appreciate, I appreciate you. It. Ultra Exosaur, my first time saying your name. We're, we're here, man. That, though, just completely turned me off. I'm out of my element now. Like, I really can't even focus anymore. But h here we go. We got, uh... Um, <laughs> here we go. We got a studio series. And we got the Blaster reissue down there. I'm pretty sure they're pretty much in every Walmart by now. We got Double Dealer and we have Scavenger. Indeed. What was I saying? Yeah, Earthrise Starscream. Every time I come, I, uh... I want to get them, but I never actually uh, buy them. <laughs> so, <laughs> um... There you go. Deluxe class, Voyager class, and Leader class are all not here. Bad, guys. Not a bad In Walmart. Still hanging out with World War II Hot Rod, which I don't think is a bad figure. I'm just not willing to get. There you go. Yeah. All right. And I think they bought Overload. Did they buy Overload? Yep. Overload is gone. This was the store that I grabbed the box, and we found two Overloads. Well, they're both gone. <laughs> so people are buying them up. I can confirm that. But no Leadfoot, no Clip Jumper. 
No topspin. No blitzwing. No overlay. Yeah. But it's all good. We will continue. That's what we do. That's that's how it is. Some hunts you find nothing. Some hunts you find everything you've ever wanted. <laughs> I just don't, never, don't you know. Don't I don't coexist with rude people. So it's hard for me to function around them. It's hard for me to function around them. All right. But as for now, <laughs> Freedom Fighters, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, slam dunk a like on it, Kobe style. Bowling. There you go. And Wakanda style. Only you can do it. <laughs> and if you guys enjoyed the video, drop a like. And as always, this is your Epic Toy Hunter. This is Leo. And we are going to catch you on the next video. Roll Peace out. Till all. Oh, I missed. <laughs> it got caught on the gimbal. <laughs> Till all are one. Peace. Peace out. Shh. <laughs> I am so out of my element. I know she probably has something to get, but it's like, girl, girl, say that, something. The fact that she just stood there. Like, the, she, she pretended like I wasn't even there. No. I got her way. You saw me. I was like, you need to get something? She didn't even answer. She could have been like, Leo. Yes, please. That yes. took so much restraint. Shuri. The next Black Panther, guys. The next Black Panther. She's the next Black Panther. It's so sad to think about that. Right? I don't want him to be a next Black Panther. I don't want Chadwick. I freaking hate mortality. mortality? <laughs> let's be immortal. Want to be immortal? No. I mean, Autobots live no, for eons. I don't want to be immortal. Okay, well, let's not be immortal, but at least live for, like, eons. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs>